Khloe Kardashian posted a thought-provoking comment on mistakes to her Instagram feed. Her statement occurred after her ex-boyfriend, Lamar Odom, apologized for pooping in his head on Celebrity Big Brother Startling Fans. Chloe came to her Instagram story on Friday to share a passage about looking back. The quotation began, In life, we do things, some things we wish we hadn't done. However, they all contribute to who we are, and in the end, they shape every detail about us. So just live your life, make mistakes, and make amazing memories. However, never second-guess who you are, where you've been, and most importantly, where you're going. Unknown, it concluded. Chloe's remark came after her ex-husband Lamar appeared to have pooped in his bed on Thursday's Celebrity Big Brother episode. In the aforementioned event, the Los Angeles Lakers champion dashed across the court in his red trunks. The basketball player felt compelled to let the world know about his bad luck. I just took a shit on my bed. Lamar admitted, No, you didn't. A female voice can be heard stating. I did, he added. I need to go clean it up, the famed athlete said as he hurried back to his bed. Chloe's ex-husband said he became unwell because he trashed his stomach on the show by consuming too much milk. Viewers were taken aback as they rushed to the Twitter comment section to express their sympathy for the sportsman and laughter at his misfortune. As one viewer put it, that's incredible. That is not the way to reclaim Chloe. A second observer added, what a pity. After that, I'd have to press the red button. A third viewer commented, For me, it's the I had to clean it up portion. He looks like he should be taking a shower. He wasn't just cleaning his hands. Um, I hope he's joking. LOL, said the fourth individual. During a recent Celebrity Big Brother show, Chloe's ex also revealed that he still hoped for a future with her. I simply want to take her out to dinner and apologize. The NBA star told Todd Recall, we took a pledge before God, and I didn't keep that, Lamar stated, referring to his infidelity. I don't think I'll ever feel complete unless I get her back, he said. Cynthia Bailey and Shannon Mochler, whose ex-husband Travis Barker is engaged to Chloe's sister Courtney, were present. The Real Housewives of Atlanta star questioned Lamar's belief that he could win Chloe back. I don't know, he said. Lamar proposed in August of 2009. They were married until 2013, and their divorce was formalized one year later in 2015, one year after Lamar's tragic near-death incident. True Thompson, Tristan Thompson's three-year-old daughter, is the couple's only child. Marilee Nichols gave birth to Tristan's third child in December 2021, after the couple had been fighting in court. He also has a five-year-old son, Prince, with his ex-girlfriend, Jordan Craig, for whom he presently pays child support. Lamar Odom is overjoyed that fans are cheering for him and his ex-wife Khloe Kardashian to reconcile. The former NBA player has spoken openly about his connection with the Keeping Up With The Kardashian star and his wish to reunite with her on Celebrity Big Brother. During a new interview following his eviction from the Big Brother house, Lamar Odom expressed gratitude that there are still supporters who want him and the good American founder to renew their romance. Actually, it's great to hear the encouragement. It's invigorating. When you marry someone in 30 days, they will always be linked to you in some way. She'll always hold a special place in my heart. On Kardashian, Odom told Us Weekly on Tuesday. The retired athlete, 40, told how Kardashian was by his side during his near-fatal overdose in 2015. At the time, he regarded her assistance as momentous. She looked after me once I awoke from my coma. I'm talking about a woman who wiped my behind when I couldn't. He elaborated, as a result, I like her. She, like myself, was full of dignity and pride. Kardashian and Odom married after only one month of dating in 2009, and they even had their own reality program, Chloe and Lamar. Four years later, they announced their divorce, with a reality star filing for divorce in December 2013. When Odom was hospitalized in 2015, Kardashian temporarily dropped her divorce suit so that she could make medical choices on his behalf. In December 2016, they formalized their divorce. During a conversation with his co-stars Cynthia Bailey, Carson Kressley, and Misha Cupcake Tate on a prior episode of CBB, Lamar Odom discussed his connection with Kardashian in further detail. 
I didn't treat that wonderful woman right, the former basketball player confessed about their breakup saying, I didn't treat that good woman right. He also expressed regret for not being mature enough at the time and expressed hope that if he were given another chance with Kardashian, he would know what to do and what not to do. And with that being said, it's time to end our video. Do you think Khloe Kardashian should get back with Lamar Odom? Let us know in the comments. Like this video and make sure to subscribe to our channel for more amazing videos like this. We'll see you in the next video.